Otis obviously was the original installer in 1931 and 32 when we completed the building and was a service provider for a long time and we were uh, awarded the, the modernization in 2009-2010 uh, to come back on and be involved with the historic project. It was a huge partnership to, to have Otis and the Empire State Building work together to complete a modernization in a fully active building. Part of it was only allowing two elevators out of, out of service at a time in each elevator bank. The G bank was only one. We also had to do shaft remediation to fix the elevator shafts from damage from Hurricane Sandy. So it was just a huge um, you know, partnership and relationship that, that just grew over the course of the modernization. Uh, so the, the reasoning behind the modernization push here was that the, the equipment, the existing controllers themselves were we're at the point of obsolete. Um, they were over 25 years old, and it was time for the upgrade, and, and Otis was the right company for the job. The elevators were modernized fully top to bottom, minus the rails. So we replaced the machine, the controller, the drive, all the components on top of the cab, door operator, all the way down to the buffers in the pit. The most challenging part of the modernization is, is not getting stuff into the building and installed. We have great mechanics to do that. It's getting big, heavy, old stuff out, and the, that was the machines for us, and we actually had to cut them into three different pieces. It was actually just a great learning experience. You got a sense of history, looking at the original machines, um, getting to work in the hoistways, and now obviously going to the second floor and seeing the pictures of the original Otis mechanics. It's just a, it was an honor and also just a, a great learning experience. The most special thing about working here during the modernization was just the team environment with the great mechanics and field personnel we had here. They solved a lot of issues on their own. Uh, it was a great learning experience for all of us as we worked through it, as well as the partnership and, and the relationship we built with the building. So we installed Otis One recently, and our mechanics really use it for the predictive maintenance piece. They can log in from their phone, look at the elevator without being in the machine room, see if any current faults came up or anything, anything showing that we may need to go do maintenance in a certain spot. So not only do our mechanics use it, but I use it, uh, our field supervisors use it, and it goes all the way up to Otis Engineering.